Good evening to you, friends. I'm Greg Merriweather here on this Friday. Boy, it was an emotional day today for the St. Helena community as dozens honored the life of the teen that was killed during this week's school shooting. Vernon Gordon Jr. died and two others were hurt. And tonight, loved ones held a vigil in his memory. Perry Robinson has more from St. Helena. Perry. Family and friends met in the park of the hometown of Vernon Gordon Jr. to celebrate the life of a son, a teammate, and a student. The pain was visible. It is a tough, tough, tough time. But the only way we're going to be able to move forward and to move forward positively is to not lose faith. Black, white, and gold balloons filled North Park in Amy. And in the middle was a picture, a dad in a memory. Family and friends honored Vernon Gordon Jr. as his uncle and principal of his school tried to instill one message to his community. It's time out for riding dirty. It's time out for doing things you know is going to catch up with you one day. It's time out for to do anything other than what's right. The 16-year-old was shot and killed in the parking lot of St. Helena College and Career Academy on Tuesday. The community came to lean on each other in their grief. You got to still believe to and pray. If you don't believe, you are going to lose. To remember, to hope. I'm still going to have some tears to cry. I know this. You still going to have some tears to cry. But we can't cry as if we have no hope. No hope. A 14-year-old was arrested and charged for killing Gordon. But deputies have not given a clear motive. As the family waits to get that final answer, they hang the on one? to one thing, okay. their faith. We had 16 years with him. We would have loved to have more time with him. But don't let this affect your ability to talk to God. How sweet. Standing hand in hand and singing side by side. In memory of VJ, they released balloons to the heavens. God got the other half. The part we don't understand. Was love. Classes all across St. Helena have been canceled since the shooting. Students will return next week. In a meet, Perry Robinson, WAFB 9 News.